So that is now my new DIY 50 watt CO2 laser. I made this laser with all components I had already at home from previous objects. So I have nothing to buy online of the most of the things I had already. So I made them with linear rails on the Y axis 15 millimeters and linear rail on the X axis also 15 millimeters. The lens holder and mirror holders are from Cloudray. Uh, now it's a uh, 50 point uh, three uh, focus uh, lens inside but you can put uh, larger or uh, smaller we have a 50 watt laser tube behind we have also a bed that we can move up and down with a stepper motor on the behind for the moment there is no honeycomb bed but you can uh, do what you want with it. Uh, now I have uh, some aluminum rods I can place where I want inside. These are fixed the outside. All the blue parts are 3D printed with tough PLA so they are very strong. For the bed I use screws uh, with a pitch of 2 millimeters uh, they are 8 millimeters in diameter we have GT2 belts strong ones uh, 6 millimeters on both sides I use stepper motor NEMA 17 so that it's the machine itself so now for the electro components, I have a control box, a reader controller, RDC 6432G. That's the display. I have also installed a milliamp. Uh, the button for the laser, uh, a button for the control box. I have three stepper drivers, the DM542 digital, one power supply for the controller and the stepper motors 24 volt 360 watt. I have a 60 watt power supply for the laser tube and there is also built in an EME filter for the current. Also on solenoid for air assist building. At the behind for the bed is a NEMA 23 stepper motor. And as you can see, the stepper motors are built like this. You see on both sides we have the same. I have all the wires are ready to mount so that it's only the the hole is the inside of the case so the mechanical parts for the case you have to make a case around the whole parts and one part will be closed and one will have a door to open. I will now show you the movements of the laser. So I'm going to power up my controller. I hope you see with the light the controller. You see we have 
I'm going to show you now menu and I go to function enter enter and I'm going to home uh, my machine as you can see we have here at the end limit switches I hope you see them you heard the click so now my machine is home and if I push my uh, arrow keys so that's the movement Okay, I will now go to my computer because this box is connected with internet. You can also use a uh, USB cable or you can use a USB directly on the device. So I have no started light burn. As you can see here, I have my reader controller is connected. So you see here the uh, working space, 440 by 500. So if I do now and check to if everything is work, if I push my button here, you will see that my laser is going exactly to that place uh, I have made slow speed to show you the slow movement so it will be here okay and I'm gonna make one little drawing so a little circle and I'm gonna cut it with because it's a 50 watt my speed is now at 16 and the power is 55, 55% and one time I will do some acrylic to show you So I put it over here. I'm gonna show you how it's cutting. Power on my laser. Okay, now the laser is on. I hope you can see it. I'm gonna Start. Uh, well, so, as you can see, it cuts very, very nice. You see the piece, okay. That's uh, three millimeters acrylic. So show that everything is working fine. Thanks for watching.